We can grab some... F oh, wine. May have some beer in here. Get a tradition back. Hey guys, Stally111 here, and today, I'm uh, playing some more Fallout New Vegas. Um, actually, I, I forgot to put my uh, HUD back on, but um, I know where I'm going. So, thank you very much for joining me. Hey there, friend. A bit of advice. You look like you could use some protection. Lucky for you, I got what you need. I'm scared. My stock and trade? All kinds of easy-to-hide weapons for slipping into and out of casinos. They won't give you a second glance. Uh, not interested. Maybe some other time, though. Suit yourself. It's not my fault if they find your body dumped in Freeside. Who's they? I want to know who they are. Please do tell me who they are. Right. I'm going to turn this HUD on, and then we're going to jump in the tops right here. Actually, no, we're not. We're going to talk to Mr. House. Right. Hello, Victor. Well, howdy, partner. Good to see you again. Boss is waiting for you upstairs, so get a move on. Okay, thank you, Verdict. Oh, thank back you very much. Now. Right. Just gonna turn the HUD on. Right here, we're back. And. Let's go. So, what will Mr. House have to say to us? I'll have to talk to him. Stars. Where to, partner? The penthouse floor. Thank you very much, Victor. So, how guys? How are you guys? I've got a little uh, question for you. Penthouse floor. Penthouse floor, right? Got a little question for you guys before I jump into more dialogue. What about? And this is just an idea that popped into my head. What about I do a Fallout New Vegas versus Fallout Three series? What do you guys have on thoughts on that? Do you think it is a good idea? Do you think you'd enjoy it? Do you think you'd watch it? Do you think I should do it? Enjoy your time on the Vegas Strip. I will do. Hello, Mr. Rose. This meeting has been a long time coming, hasn't it? You've come a long ways, literally and, I suspect, figuratively as well. I have to ask, now that you've reached your destination, what do you make of what you see? Um... A city devoted to vice and sin. What the hell? It's, n it's nothing that you don't love here. Oh, come now. Don't play the fool. Vegas has fools enough. A superfluity of them. They're what makes it so profitable. They come to Vegas chasing penny-ante dreams of high living to feel like they're big shots, like they're winners. You see that you and I are of a different stripe, don't you? We don't have to dream that we're important. We are. Thank you. Why the VIP treatment? I'm just a courier, but I do I do enjoy the VIP treatment. Oh, don't be coy. You've been playing a high-stakes game ever since Victor dug you out of the ground. Don't be afraid to admit it. All right, let's get down to business. The business is this. One of my employees has stolen an item of extraordinary value from me, and I want it recovered. Simple enough. Okay. What do you propose? My only concern is the recovery of the platinum chip. What happens to Benny, I leave to your discretion. When you bring the chip to me, I will pay you four times the delivery bonus stipulated in your contract. How's that? Ah, that's a good start, but we'll well below the market price. Very well. Five times the bonus. Not one cap more. Very, very clever man. Well enough. 
Return to me when you have the platinum chip in your possession. Any final matters for us to discuss? I'll return when I have the chip. Wait, I was going to get then. 250 caps for this job? Jesus, originally. Right, let's um, talk to Benny. And, um, I need to talk to Victor, that's it. Congratulations, partner. The boss has instructed me to comp you to the high roller suite. You can bring your friends, too. Be like a little clubhouse for the gang you put together. Just bear in mind, you're the only one who gets to see the boss. Any friends you got, they can wait in the suite. Fine by me. Enjoy the dates, partner. They're plenty fancy. I will do. Thank you very much. Uh, Victor, let's go to the casino. Right, let's go to the tops. I'm just going to explain to you what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to let Benny go. So we can get a little bit more... Let's just say rough with him. And by rough, I mean so I can kick his ass in an arena that is pretty awesome. And also, hey look, we get fame. More fame. Hey, you there. I have oh, a shit. message for you. Oh, yeah. It's from Ambassador Nobody cares. It's hey, NCR. I don't fucking Someone's care about them. Out of the yep, I'm God, people. Wow. That's crazy. What the fuck is that? I should part your hat. <laughs> I thought that was just your hair just being really stupid. But yeah, sure, we get fame from the Legion, and also we get to kick Benny's ass. And of course, we are going with the Legion. Hey, hey, fellow, welcome to the Tops Hotel and Casino. I'm gonna have to ask. Sure. Here you go. Smooth and easy, just the way I like it. Don't worry, they'll be as safe as kittens till you're ready to leave. Oh, and a friendly word of advice. If you happen to stumble across any weapons during your stay here, well, just don't wear them openly. You dig? Now that we got that little business out of the way, what can I do to make your Tops experience the Tops? That is absolutely fine, mister. Have a good time, baby. I will do. Right, swank. Hello. Hey there, pal. Welcome to the tops. And what can I do for you today? I think you should know something about Benny. Really? You got something to say about the big boss, huh? Well, why don't you say it to his face instead of yapping at me? I don't think you're gonna like this. I like it. Seems that Benny's been making his own play. Huh? What are you talking about? Benny tried to kill me. He stole the platinum chip and I was hired. I can't even speak. He stole the platinum chip that I was hired to deliver. That doesn't. Why would he pull a stunt like that? Got anything else to offer? That's it. What do you think? I think you might just be onto something here, kid. Tell you what. I can't actively back your play, but I'll keep the chairman off your back. I'll tell the doorman you're cool to pack heat inside. Trust me, you're gonna need it. You'll still have to deal with Benny's private goon squad, though. I got no play with those cats. You want more help? I'll need more proof. That's fine by me. Yeah, see ya, kid. Did you get my stuff back? Yeah, buddy. Right, let's get... Oh. Let's just talk to him. Uh, let's hit the barter up and medicine. Right. For some reason, I can't actually see the uh, marker I've got. Maybe it's just I don't have. Oh, it is. No, it's still, I can't see it. It's over here. Oh, there he is. Hello. You have a nice gun. Hey, hey Benny. What in the goddamn? Let's keep this in the groove, hey? Smooth moves, smooth. Hello. The guy everyone saw go in the Lucky 38, that was you? Oh, shit. Seems you have to work on your marksmanship, mister. 
I hit what I was aiming for. Guess you had brains to spare. Or you just thick skulled. Either way, baby, this is good news. Maybe I can finally sleep at night, <laughs> knowing you didn't <laughs> Funny die. guy. What say you and me cash out? Go somewhere it's more private like. Any questions you got, I'll answer. Fine by me. What do you got in mind? To start, I'll comp you the presidential. Best suite in the house. You deserve a taste of the VIP lifestyle. I'll hang out down here for a while to make everything look business as usual, then come to you. Any questions you got, I'll answer. Guaranteed. Okay. I'll be right back. Sorry about that. Right, um... The suite's a nice touch, but someone's gotta pay off my contract. Where's my manners? Here's some cash up front. There'll be more where that came from. Wait for me in the presidential suite. Dig this crazy slang. I comp you the pres so we can talk there, eh? Okay, well he's not gonna be there. Most likely. Right, I gotta be prepared, cause I think his goons might be after me. Can't really remember exactly how it goes, but we can grab some f oh, wine. Might have some beer in here. Get the tradition back. Hmm, sadly not. <laughs> See what's in the safe. Hmm, I'm crippled. Nice wee meeting room. Oh, what do we have up there? They're all empty. Why the hell are they empty? Right, none of them look like beer balls. Let's look for the bathroom. Is this the bathroom? Yeah. Ah, bugger. I was hoping for a medi medical pack. Maybe in this bathroom? No. Well, let's have a have, have a little sleep. Hopefully, heal our wounds. And we shall see. Uh, let's go to the intercom. Baby, this little meet and greet of ours, chalk me up as a no-show. It would be 41 flavors of stupid to let you get a drop on me. And you've caused plenty of... You've forced my hand. Hell, I gotta skip town because of you. A real pain in the caboose. Great. <sighs> the least you could do is answer me some questions first. A lifelong learner is you, eh? Then make your questions count because your lifelong is running life short. All I am is a courier trying to fulfill my contract. All this is just work ethic run wild? That's your line? I don't know. Can you get it through your thick skull to leave me in the chip alone? If bullets can't get through, what hope is there? Uh, you're a dead man. That temper of yours. Kind of why this conversation's taking place over an intercom. Great. Do me a favor and stay dead this time, eh? Good night, all. It's been a gas. Over here! Had enough. Come on. Come on. Bam. 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 Nice. Easy as pie. This is why this gun is insane. It's got a nice wee fedora in this house. Ammo, sounds pistol, Benny sweet key. Sounds pistol. Don't know why I keep on picking up the sweet key. I see the sunglasses. Cause why the hell not? Right, let's um. Hopefully we can repair right.
repair. Boom. Anything else we can repair? Repairal. No, let's just drop that. Eh, why not? Take a look, right? We can drop some of this for sure. Caravan deck. Don't think I'm gonna be playing caravan, but. <laughs> Purified water, let's have that. Scotch, stealth boy. Trail mix. A vodka. Just take some wine. Maybe not, I'm not sure. Don't know what I'm gonna do. Right, so we've got cracks on our screen now because we've got damaged sunglasses. Let's have a little nap and then we'll continue on. Right, let's go out of the, uh, the tops now. Let's see if there's anyone on the intercom. Cleaners will not twice. Make sure they're thorough. What the fuck? Let's talk to Swank. Hello. This is just swell. Benny Vamooses and I'm left holding the bag. What do you need, kid? Okay, nothing at yeah. all about Benny. Okay. Alright. The eyes of the mighty Kaisar are upon you. He admires your accomplishments and bestows upon you the exceptional gift of his mark. Any crimes you may have perpetrated against the Legion are hereby forgiven. Kaisar will not extend this mercy a second time. Good. My lord requires your presence at his camp at Fortification Hill. His mark will guarantee your safe conduct through our lands. Incidentally, it will interest you to know that the man you seek has fled the Strip and is likely making haste for Kaisar's camp as we speak. You again? How did you find me? I am the greatest of Kaisar's frumentari. It was not a challenge to find you. Nor is this my first visit to the Strip. Okay. If this is going to be a trap, I'm going to take a lot of you guys down with me. The mighty Kaisar has bestowed upon you his mark and guaranteed safe conduct. If he wanted you dead, you would be dead already. No, I wouldn't. Seek Kaisar by way of Cottonwood Cove, south of Nelson. The Corsor Lucullus will be waiting. Okay. Right, so, I'm just going to stop the episode here, it's a little bit short, but uh, we're going to start off finally getting to see Kaiser and the Kaiser's Legion in Fortification Hill, and we're going to beat up any next episode, so yeah. Um, thank you very much for watching, my name is stally 11 and I hope you guys have enjoyed. And uh, yeah, see you guys next time. Make sure to drop a like, drop a comment, and subscribe if you've not done so already. Peace off, guys.